The last two tests, Patrick's test. You do need to know this one. This one will come in very handy next week. The Patrick's test, or Faber, involves flexion of the hip. Okay? Flexion of the hip. <coughs> Abduction of the hip. And external rotation of the hip. It's a three part. Now you don't have to go through all of these maneuvers in order to get there, okay? You can go, okay, lift your leg up and bring it in like this, all right? It's ex explanation of how it got its name and what the movements are that make up this uh, test. Once you have them in this position with their ankle just above the patella, you want to apply slight downward force on the knee. Basically, again, stressing the SI joint in the back. So, Faber's test, another test for sacroiliitis. So you have Faber's, you have Gainsland's. The next test is the piriformis test, which is basically this test. All I do is I take the patient's ankle and I move it over onto the table and apply downward pressure. What this does is it changes the force. From here, I was applying force on the SI joint. Once I move this over to here, now what I've done is I've brought in the piriformis muscle. Remember when we were looking at it on the slide today and I talked to you about piriformis syndrome and how the piriformis muscle can compress on the sciatic nerve and cause pain? Well, that's what this is a test for. This is a test for piriformis syndrome. This is a test for sacroiliacus. Any questions on Faber? Because you will need to do this. For the piriformis test, after you move the ankle to the table, are you still putting pressure on the knee? Yes. Oh. Yeah. You're just, in, when I'm in this position, my goal is to try to get the knee down even with the other knee. That's my goal. Now, an 88-year-old person, that may not happen. You may only get about this far, if that. Okay, but my goal in a healthy or young person is to be able to bring that knee down equal. Here, it's not my goal. My goal is to bring the knee down and to apply pressure on that piriformis muscle in order to compress that. Okay, so any questions on that? All right, uh, let's do that for about 10 minutes and then I'll bring